Hi guys and welcome to this video. Well, I do look like a mess and I do have some swatches on my hand, but don't mind me. I'm here today to open, unbox and try the Ricky Loves Ricky mirror. And if you want to see me opening this, then please keep on watching. <music> Okay, guys, so this is, let's talk. I do love mirrors and I do have a couple of hand mirrors and I had like this, let me show you. And I had this mirror for ages and I think I bought it in Ikea or something and I really like it, but when I apply my night cream, my face cream and my products at night and I always need to put the um, my ring light on because I can't see when the light is off if my husband sleeps and I don't want to wake him up and I'm going to bed after him or uh, it's kind of long on the other side of the room to switch to turn on and off the lights and I don't have anything here where I have my beauty space so for me to see myself in the mirror it's almost imp impossible so I need to have my ring light on and I hate turning it on <laughs> it really gives a lot of light so I wanted a mirror with some lights on and I looked at a couple of them but I never bought any until I saw uh, Linda Halberg's Linda Halberg's Insta story, Instagram story last week or a couple of days ago she showed the Ricky mirror that she bought she had one for ages and it was broken so she finally bought another one and I saw that you can pair it with I with your phone to have you know you can charge it you can take you it with you you can take pictures um together with you know, pair it with the phone and you take some pictures with that mirror and I fell in love it's expensive <laughs> It's very expensive, but they had 25% off on the website where I bought it, so I immediately ordered it. But I will link down below where I did purchase it here in Sweden. And sometimes they have also sales, so if they have on a sale and you want this mirror, you can wait for that sale and purchase it because it's expensive. But I love it. So I'm going to show you when I um, open this and start to try when I unbox this mirror and then we'll be back to talk about pros and cons and what I like and not, what I like and don't like about this mirror so see you. okay so let's open the box That's five stage. All these things come in. Let's open.
is beautiful. So, on this card that came, we do have instructions how to take selfies and use the product, the mirror. So let's take it out. I'm so nervous. Oh, oh it's stunning. It's beautiful. And we have the stamp. So this is the mirror. It looks beautiful. I will clean my desk and put it up and then we'll uh, remove this plastic and try it. But this is the this is the phone clip that you can place with a magnet. For taking the pictures. I'm so nervous. I don't want to break it. And then we have a big mirror and the mirror that also has my net no I didn't expect that so there you go I think I need to maybe take the plastic off yeah no now it works um. last thing here that we have in this packaging is actually I think charger yes the charger so I will try charge this mirror and we'll try it oh nice I forgot to take the plastic off though. I'm so excited. Difficult to put this in. So leave it, we will leave it here to charge. It takes four hours for it to be full charge and it says that this is going to get dark. The charging lamp is going to go dark after around 30 seconds. And uh, nice, I love it. It's cute. We'll try it out later when it's charged. So the lights are off. Sorry guys, I know my desk is not the cleanest right now, but I'm going to clean and fix it up a little bit this is my filming this is my ring light and my new studio lights over here um there i had other big ones so they kind of took so much space and i have my brushes and the things i'm using right now palettes and rest of the stuff this is my window i need to fix the curtains so okay that's it but this is the mirror Hello, I don't have makeup, I look like a mess. I'm going to film now, but um, okay. Let's remove this, or how do I remove this? Oh, this is the back side, okay. Okay, um, I need to put down this one. Sorry guys for shaking or for not filming professionally. Okay, so this is on the other side. So there is, I think, plastic on the other side too. 
that we are going to remove. Oh, it's so, I don't know if you can see, it's satisfying. Okay, so let's put it on. It's not heavy at all, but um, it's not even the, it's not the, also the easiest or lightest mirror, but let's do this. Ooh. And that's my camera. Hello, guys. So let's see now if we can. Oh, wow. Okay. Second, third, fourth, fifth. So that's five. Oh, it's so beautiful. I love it. I love it. And it's amazing. I love it. Um, usually in the morning when I'm, or at the night, at night when I'm um, applying my makeup, like I said in the beginning, I don't need to put up my ring light or turn it on. And I don't like doing that all the time. So I want a mirror. I had one mirror. Uh, the small, just round one before without any lights, but I heard about this one and of course I wanted to try it, so yay! Love it! Okay, so what do I like about this mirror? I like that you get this for your phone, so you can put it on the mirror and take pictures. I like that you have this kind of mirror to zoom in a little bit. I also like the size of the mirror. I also like the stand that you can actually kind of, you know, place it higher or lower if you want to. And the mirror is not heavy. I like the lights that you can, um, you know, have the strong light if you want. Let me show. This is the first, the lowest set. Second, third, fourth, or fifth. That's really strong. You can see every zit. Don't recommend it. Okay, this is the lower setting. I love it. I really like it. I also like how easy it's to carry it with your phone. And I did try to take some pictures and it looked, it was very easy. Sorry, I just want to put it down. It, it was very easy to pair it with the phone and take selfies. So that's terrific. Also to charge it was very easy. Kind of had hard time to put in the charger, but maybe that's because we're nervous to break the mirror or something. I don't know. So that's what I like. What I don't like about it, it's that the magnet that you attach this and the phone that you can attach these two to is in the center of the mirror. So you can't place it higher up on any side or lower down to see yourself in, or to watch yourself. Um, if you want to, you need to Put it in the center of the mirror that's the only that's the thing i don't really really like because i wanted to place this lower down down lower on the mirror so i could see some you know see myself in the mirror but i couldn't i had to have this in the center maybe you can i i maybe it's just this mirror but i couldn't really no it doesn't want to stick it's like the magnet is in the center the most of it is the center so the mirror, it does slide down lower, but this magnet for the phone, no, you need to have it almost in the center. Maybe just a little bit on the side. Maybe I can show you. Like this. There you go. It's a little bit dirty, but I did use it. Have powder all over it, but that's how you need to have it. There's this, this one thing I really, that, that kind of bothers me. I can live with it, but it does bother me. So if you considering to buy this and it's very important for you to have the phone a little bit low, lower down below, that's not going to be possible. Love the lights. Uh, I have to say, I read a couple of comments that the light at the lowest setting is strong. So people ha get, get irritated or it bothers their eyes and gave them headaches. I can say that it's very strong. I think the lowest setting is kind of strong. It's a little bit, it's strong. And if you look at yourself very closely using this too, to look and like I did fix my eyebrows, 
when I went all away from the mirror, you know, sometimes when you stare in the lights, you close your eyes and you can see the lights and you can see it when you walk. That's how it was for me for like four or five minutes. So it does need some time for your eyes to adjust. Now, I, my eyes adjust very fast because I use ring lights and spotlights, or ring lights and studio lights when I film. So my eyes get used to it faster. But if it bothers you, if you're sensitive to light, maybe that this mirror is not for you. But I really enjoy it and I really like it. And I'm glad that I purchased it. It's very expensive, so I hope it will... Um, work for a very long time very long time i hope I, it will last at least a couple of years to actually be good use for the money you know if the brakes and stops working a couple of months then i just wasted my money and i don't know do i have insurance maybe i do i'm not really sure but I, when you purchase on their website you can actually purchase the insurance to one year or two years but it didn't because it's wasn't really possible here. I have to also say that on their website they do have bags, travel bags for this mirror. That was everything and Linda Halber made me buy this. That's for sure. It was her Snapchat, no it's not, not Snapchat, Instagram story that actually made me buy this mirror. I didn't even heard about it but I did see it sometimes but I, I wasn't really interested but she made me interested so thank you for that. Don't forget to like this video subscribe, hit that notification bell, and see you in my next video. Bye!